I want you guys to ask yourself a real question. What would it take for you to be comfortable financially? Is it a hundred million dollars? Is it a billion dollars? Is it a uh, hundred billion dollars? Is it, what, what is it gonna take now for you to be comfortable to and for your family to be comfortable? I am Legion, my avatar is He-Man, Prince of Polarity, Queen of Duality. I am commander of every energy that's in me, the resurrector of every dead or alive of things. Lord of the necro bitches with nice titties, fat ass or skinny, demigod or pure bloody. Funny or serious, curious or all-knowing, guilty or innocent, everything in between it. Pretty legs, ankle bracelet, ain't working on a plantation, I make my own plantation, I am every plantation, courage, no insecurity, freedom passing through, necronomicon, sacred whore having sex with you, inside a pyramid, physio pattern hybrid, Sherman Alexis, energy invoke what I did, trauma symbols, repetition, I know my power, die nigga, but do it well, prepare kingdom for final hour, necronomicon, bow before Simeon, Cook me a breakfast in kitchen with just your house shoes on That means no panties on, that means restrictions gone And draw my symbols on your body to further turn me on While I sit on my throne, dripping of blood and bones I create a space for you to flourish and children to roam All hail Caesar's home, Babylon fucking Rome My soul sings a song, I titled it Solar Man What do you think it's gonna take? Would you be satisfied if you was making a million or two million dollars a year? Would you be satisfied if you was making five hundred thousand dollars a year? I'm trying to get y'all to see something. We have been taught to lust after money. When the truth of the matter is, we already were kings and queens, and we had different types of things that represented royalty that represented us. But did we have all that money in order for us to have the status that we so desperately desire to have? I am Legion, my avatar is He-Man, Prince of Polarity, Queen of Duality. I am commander of every energy that's in me, the resurrector of every dead or alive of things. Lord of the necro, bitches with nice titties, fat ass or skinny, demigod or pure bloody. Funny or serious, curious or all-knowing, guilty or innocent, everything in between it. Pretty legs, ankle bracelet, ain't working on a plantation. I make my own plantation. I am every plantation. Courage, no insecurity, freedom passing through. Necronomicon, sacred whore having sex with you. Inside a pyramid, physio pattern hybrid. Sherman Alexis invoke the energy. What I did. Trauma symbols, repetition. I know my power, die nigga, but do it well. Prepare kingdom for your final hour. Necronomicon. That means no panties on, that means restrictions gone And draw my symbols on your body to further turn me on While I sit on my throne, dripping of blood and bones I create a space, you can flourish and your children are Rome All hail Caesar's home, Babylon, fucking Rome My soul sings, I call it Solar Man And make sure you charge your stones in the sun you guys, if you guys have crystals, you should always make sure you charge your crystals every single day in the sun. There should never be a day where you're not charging up every single crystal that's in your house. One of your crystals has spirits on them. They have the ability to communicate to you. You should be naming your crystals. Give them a name. You should be talking to your crystals, not treat them like stones because they're not stones. Okay? There's all kinds of things that you can actually do with your crystals and the sun for that matter. But you got to start building a relationship with your crystals because they are beings. They are sentient beings. Okay? So every day, yes, every day. When you say every day though, every day, every single day, you should be charging up your crystals. Every single day. You should never go a day where you're not charging up your crystals. Your crystals are alive. You don't give them light, you don't give them life, then they turn into stone. Okay? And there's all types of different beings out there that can eat crystals. We can even eat crystals. Okay? Certain ones, we can eat them. Depending on who you really are.